Hey guys, what's going on? Daryl Addison at TorpedoPont.com. And, uh, you know, I designated this area specifically for my tomatoes. Um, we have a lilac and, and then some beets that uh, came back from last year. But for the many of these pots, we uh, have them dedicated towards tomatoes, for tomatoes. And an East planter, we're gonna try to do about 15 to 17 to 20 tomatoes in each planter, uh, plants in each planter. And really just really hoard it up with tomatoes. High density, high density. And see how they work out, uh, how they work out. Might throw some beans in there also with it just to see what goes on. So tomatoes have a very complex and they can achieve huge deep root systems. But uh, when we're growing them in the torpedo pot and we build up the uh, biotic environment, they tend to, um, to do a lot of branching because there's a lot of food made available. They don't have to really search as far. So you don't need the long root systems that you would normally have. Dara Addison at torpedopot.com. We're ready to put them in. The temperature hit 20 something degrees two nights ago. And it, yesterday night it hit, um, I think it was around 32, 33 degrees. And it just, it just killed everything. It just destroyed everything. But all the plants in my torpedo pot survived. So far, we're not seeing any death at all. And uh, we're working to approve that process to make sure you won't see any death at all. That's why we put so much design and scientific uh, um, force and direction into making sure these pots work for you. All right, so I'm gonna either put tomatoes in or have some plants left over I got from my uh, grower. I'll put those uh, cold weather plants in, let them sit and uh, eat them up and then put my tomato seeds in after that and see what happens. Or I'll just put my tomato seeds in now and hoping that maybe um, the temperature next week will hit about 60 to 70 degrees. If it does, I'll be, should be pretty good. But uh, hitting 60 degrees is seem to be a challenge right now. Okay, guys, talk to you later. Dow Addison at torpedopot.com. And I love this lilac. That's going to be so pretty. Look at this. Look at that lilac. Isn't that beautiful? Just look at that lilac. That is absolutely stunning. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful bush. It was, uh, it grew, it doubled in size. Uh, more than doubled in size, but, and the, the, the flowers of this are amazing. This lilac is an amazing plant. The torpedo pot allows it to, it's been in this planter now for about a year, over a year. And so, hey, we're gonna give it a try and see what happens. Talk to you guys later. Darratus at torpedopot.com.